What's going on guys? Welcome back to another Photopea tutorial. We are back again and in this one I'm going to be showing you guys how you can outline any image if that means it's a person or something in a video game. I'm going to show you guys how to do it super easily so let's get started. Okay, so the first thing you want to do is you want to have your image. And for this example, I'm going to show you some random guy I found on the internet. I just looked up person. And I'm going to outline him. So all you got to do is go over to your toolbar on the left. Find the one that looks like a paintbrush with a dotted line around it. Make sure you choose quick selection. And now you can see your cursor turned into a circle. So up here you can adjust the size of it. And the hardness so I'm gonna make it about 40 and you're just gonna want to left click on them anywhere and you should see a dotted line around the object like this some pictures work better than others like the background is a solid color kind of and that helps a lot if there was a lot of stuff going on in the background it might pick up some in the background so you'll have to go to your lasso tool and outline them that way which is a pain but Sometimes that's what you got to do. So his suit is outlined, but not his head. So I just click on his head, highlights his head, and a little bit of this is not. And that's the best I can get it. I tried getting the whole thing, but it just selected the entire picture. So Control Z, that's the best I can get it. Once you have your object selected, hit Control C and Control V. And you'll see over here in your layers, it made just him and there's some problems with it over here but that's fine because you'll see what happens so I'm gonna put the background back on now if you double click on the new layer you just made you can go to stroke and you can add a stroke on them like right here it, it, it kind of is messed up but it's it's hard to get it perfect um, but I could show you how to do it with the lasso tool right after this okay so we're gonna start out with the polygonal lasso select so click on that now zoom in a little bit to where you're pretty close okay this will work I guess so click polygonal now start somewhere I'm just gonna start right here and just click to add new points until you get completely around them it doesn't have to be perfect you can make it perfect but I'm not going to because it'll still look fine. So you just want to select all the way around him. And I'll be back in a second once I finish. I had to restart because I accidentally deselected the whole thing. But if you mess up, hit delete on your keyboard and it'll go back to the last change you made. Do not hit control Z because that messes it up. So like I messed up the ear, so just hit delete until it's fixed. Like this so just a little warning there okay so I'm getting closer to finishing I am towards the bottom I'll show you what you do when you get to the end so now I'm at the end so I'm just gonna connect it back to the starting point and it should outline him like this so now what you want to do is hit control C and control V and now he looks very sharp <laughs> so all you want to do is double click on that layer we made and do the same thing it looks all right. I mean, it's better than before where his face was kind of distorted. But that's another way you can do it. Okay, so for the next tool, I'm going to be showing you how to use a magnetic lasso tool. And a little tip is to pull your picture up so the bottom is flat if your object is kind of like off the image. Because it'll start trying to go up and around his hand and stuff. But the flat bottom will help that. So go up here to your lasso tool choose magnetic lasso select start down at the bottom again and just work your way up this one works really well because the background is solid and it's not trying to go around those objects it's just trying to go around him so i would definitely recommend it if the background is solid to use the magnetic lasso select see how fast it is i'm already almost around him and then connect back to the start and there you go now hit control c and control v and 
Now we got our layer. I'm going to add a stroke. There you go. That's how you do it with that. And those are the easiest ways you can do it. There's also the regular lasso select, which you'll have to like freehand that. Like if I start drawing up, you just have to like select him, but it, it gets, it's bad. Don't do that, honestly. But that's it, guys. I hope this helped you. If it did, leave a like and subscribe. I'm almost at a thousand subscribers, which is crazy. I'll probably do a giveaway for a thousand, but I'm broke, so we'll see. Might be a little bit after. I guess I'll see you guys later.